think it's really important, especially if we're all feeling really good like shit, that we pay really good attention to like what our actual limits are and yeah. not get ourselves bad altitude sickness and then have to go all the way down. Mm -hmm. Because we have to go all the way down regardless. And, uh, at one point I woke up and thought I was going to vomit out my guts, but I held it in. All right. And uh, fell back asleep. Excellent. Feel good now. Nice. It maybe wouldn't have required a $3 cup of instant coffee, but waking up with something hot, hot. that tastes good, and yeah. not just like hot water. Like, I really don't like emergency. Like, if, it, if you really like emergency, like, that probably works. <laughs> oh. Morning in the mountains, your thoughts. <laughs> I don't know, I feel stoned. <laughs> Like, my eyes kind of feel glossed, like, this is so pretty. I had a dream that that mountain, that one right there, was coming down to get me last night. It is. I knew you slipped something in my ramen. <laughs> I'm a little overwhelmed. I think uh, it's gorgeous. It's beautiful. What are you doing in the there? sun is rising. I, uh, it's chilly, but it's not that cold. So, 10 out of 10. I'm trying very hard not to take a shit right now. <laughs> <laughs> Moist. <laughs> it's a good workout though. These quick facts on my friend. When we were summiting at Torrey's Peak, I hated the switchbacks because I was like, I just need to get out and be done. Uh -huh. But this is like, we have all day. I'm mentally prepared for it to be all day. So it's like, yeah. if I can not feel like I'm dying while I'm walking. Yeah. Uh, 14,256. Summit is about 14.5. So we're, I would say, probably about a half mile from Summit and then about 250 uh, feet up. Feet of elevation. Last so. break until we reach the top. It's been a freaking journey. It's been a journey, man. Yeah. It's not the days in your life, but the life in your days that count. What a you.